Welcome to the University of the West of Scotland. The Information Technology Department, or IT, are here to help you get the most out of IT, audiovisual services and equipment during your time at the University. Everything to do with the use and accessibility of services, as well as resolving any IT or AV issues you may experience. Logging on. Before logging on to our network and using our systems for the first time, you will require the Microsoft Authenticator app. You will use this on a regular basis to provide multi-factor authentication to gain access to UWS systems. It can be downloaded from the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store. Once you have it downloaded and installed, don't open it. First, open an internet browser on a laptop or PC and go to office.com. Sign in using your UWS student email address as the username in the format banner ID at studentmail.uws.ac.uk. For example, B00111111 at studentmail.uws.ac.uk and your one-time temporary password, which was included in your enrolment instruction letter. If asked, select Work or School Account. Now follow the on-screen instructions to complete the setup of the Authenticator app on your smartphone. During the setup, you will be prompted to change your password. In the interests of security, it should be a minimum of 14 characters long and must include an uppercase letter and a number. Special characters can also be used. Consider using three random words. You will then be ready to go and can start using the Office apps via office.com or install them on your device. There are Apple Mac computers and PCs available to use on campus. Whichever you are using, the login process is the same. Your username when logging on is your UWS student email address. Please remember to always log out of the computer you are using at the end of your session. UWS Student App. The main student resource for information is the UWS Student App. You will use it throughout your studies and it will take you through the different stages from induction to becoming a fully enrolled UWS student. It is available online at https colon forward slash forward slash studentapp.uws.ac.uk. You can also download the UWS Student App from the Apple App Store and the Google Play Store. Student Email. From the UWS Student App, you can access your student email. Your user ID is in the format banner ID at studentmail.uws.ac.uk. For example, B00111111 at studentmail.uws. .ac.uk. Your password is the same as your login password. To reset, or if you have forgotten your password, you can change it in the Authenticator app. Select your UWS account in the Authenticator app and then select Change Password. Then follow the on-screen instructions. In the interests of security, it should be a minimum of 14 characters long and must include an uppercase letter and a number. Special characters can also be used, and consider using three random words. Stay cyber secure at UWS. Students are unfortunately a common target for spammers and hackers. Attempts to compromise your account will normally be via email with the intention of getting you to give your login details, including your password. If your account is compromised, it will be used to send more phishing emails, which will result in Microsoft locking your account. It can take up to 48 hours for access to be restored to you. To avoid this, never give your password away via email or text. Report suspicious emails to IT. IT will never ask you for your password details or to change your password via email. Only change your password using the Microsoft Authenticator app. If you cannot change it via the app, 
you must come to the hub or come to the IT office on campus and bring along some photographic ID. Don't click on email links or open attachments unless you have confidence in the sender. Use a strong secure password at least 14 characters long. Aula is your virtual learning environment where you can access course information, exam details, project details and other documents relating to your course. This is your main portal for university related work and you will use it on a regular basis. You can access Aula from the UWS student app. To check exam results and personal details, you will use self-service banner, which can also be accessed through the UWS student app. OneDrive. OneDrive is the cloud storage service offered by Microsoft and as such, it can be used to store and retrieve your data from anywhere you have an internet connection. OneDrive can be accessed at onedrive.com. Sign in using your student email address and password. OneDrive is a Microsoft resource. The university is not responsible for any loss of data. Any data deleted and error can be retrieved from the recycle bin up to 30 days from deletion. Wi-Fi. To access the internet from your mobile device via the university's student Wi-Fi network, you are required to log in using your email address and password. This is usually quite straightforward for mobile phones and tablets, but laptops and MacBooks may have to be configured. Scan the QR code for access to the how-to guides for equipment and operating systems. To access UWS resources from a laptop or a MacBook, connect your device to the UWS Student Wireless Network. This provides a safe and secure connection that protects your data and devices. Access to IT equipment. There are a number of ways in which you can access and use IT equipment on campus. 1. Labs. PCs and labs are available to you where there is no class in progress. 2. Open access areas. PCs are available to you for use in the library areas. Some desks in the library also have docks which allow you to connect your personal laptops to see the screens. 3. Laptops are available for loan on all campuses via our LapSafe service. These devices can be checked out by you. Just bring along your student ID card. The devices can only be used on campus and must be returned on the same day to make the service fair for all. Printing. When you are logged in with your UWS student email address and password, any prints you make will be charged to your print credit. This is initially set up with £10. Your print balance can be checked through the UWS student app and you can top up your credit online at epayments.uws.ac.uk forward slash print. Copies cost five pence per sheet or 10 pence per sheet if you use color. Please note that we cannot refund leftover credit at the end of the year or at the end of your course. AI tools. Microsoft Copilot is the supported platform for AI. Always consider when using Copilot what information you are sharing, as once it has been shared via Copilot, it may then be available to be accessed by anyone. Always be protective of your data and particularly personal information, which may be considered sensitive. How to contact IT. Log a request or issue with IT via the self-service portal at https colon forward slash forward slash uws dot topdesk dot net. Select the IT tile, then select the log a call tile. Text our automated response service on WhatsApp, which is available 24-7 on 0141 848 3998. Phone on 0141 848 3999 between 8.30am 
and 7 p.m. Monday to Thursday, between 8.30 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. on a Friday, and between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. on a Saturday. Acceptable use policy. You must not use the university network to create, access, or transmit any material of an offensive, obscene, or indecent nature. You must not create or transmit material which is likely to cause annoyance, inconvenience, anxiety, defamation, or contravenes the hate crime legislation. Anyone breaking the acceptable use policy will be subject to discipline. Please remember to contact the IT Service Desk if you have any issues. And we wish you every success with your studies at UWS.